of families of our future kindergartners. We are gonna be showing you some things that you can do to help your child prepare for kindergarten at Lakeview Primary. How can you help your child? One of the things you can do is have your child practice taking turns. You can do this with playing games and make sure that when you're having conversations that they wait until it is their turn to talk. Also encourage learning from their mistakes. If they make a mistake, say it's okay. They learned from it and then move on and help them try and figure out how to correct it. Support their vocabulary. If you're looking at a ball and they say ball, make sure that they describe it. Is it a big ball? Is it a little ball? Is it blue? Is it green? Using those vocabulary words will help when they come to kindergarten. Also, make sure you're using those words. If you ask them to go get something, make sure that it's very specific. Encourage imagination, and one of the ways you can do this is by having story time with them. Read different books. Encourage them to talk about the books. Encourage that imagination, whether it's building a fort or being a princess or a pirate. These are some of the ways you can help your child. One of the important things that your child's gonna need when they come into kindergarten is fine motor skills. These are those muscles that within our hands that allow them to be able to grip a pencil or grip a crayon or be able to cut with scissors. Some of the things that you can do this summer while you are working with your child is allow them to work with different items when drawing or coloring. So you can use crayons or colored pencils or markers or chalk, anything that they can use that is different from just a straight pencil. Encourage them to play with Play-Doh. Encourage them to cut or rip paper. Move items with tongs or tweezers. This helps with that pinching so that they will be able to grip a pencil once they come to school. Have them practice buttoning a shirt, zipping up a jacket, sorting objects into different places. Help you put away dishes out of the dishwasher and encourage them to put on their own clothes. So what are some of the skills that your child's gonna need when they come to kindergarten? They're gonna need to be able to dress themselves, use the restroom on their own, be able to tie their shoes, and wash their hands using soap and water. They're also going to need to be able to put things away. So this is something you can practice at home. Have to put away materials. They're gonna have to be able to put them away, not just away, but put them away nicely. Another thing that you can practice with them is opening items, like lunch items. So if they're having a snack at home, have them open the bag. Have them close their sandwich bags or open their sandwich bags. Have them practice opening a milk container. These are things that you can practice with them. The other thing is personal space. And this is a hard one because at home, usually they're allowed to be in your lap or close to you. But when they come to school, they will need to understand personal space away from their friends. Have them practice that personal space. We call it the hula hoop. Put a hula hoop around you, that's your personal space. So what can you do to start preparing now? One of the things you can do is set up routines and schedules. When your child comes to kindergarten, they will have a schedule that will be followed. They will know what they're doing and when they're doing it. This can be done and practiced at home by getting up at a certain time, brushing their teeth, making their bed, going to bed at a certain time, making sure you have that routine in the morning and in the evening. Make sure your child's getting adequate sleep. Set a bedtime and stick to it. School starts here at 8 a.m. and they will need to be here before that. So make sure that they're getting enough sleep. We don't have nap time in kindergarten anymore. Encourage your child to ask questions. If they see something and point to it, make sure they're using a complete sentence and asking that question. We need them to talk. We need them to be able to ask if they need something. I need a pencil. May I please go to the bathroom? Also, practice following two to three step directions. What this means is that you're asking them to do multiple things in a row. I need you to go to the bathroom, brush your teeth, wash your face, and get on your pajamas. You're asking them once, but they have to go remember what they need to do. Those are multiple step directions. Thank you for watching this video, and we hope that this is a big help in helping to prepare your child for kindergarten. If you have any additional questions, you can call the office at any point in time over the summer and they would be happy to assist you. See you in the fall!